What's up guys, Christian Skies here, and we are back with another video and a brand new series. So, uh, we're finishing up our KSP series pretty soon, and I wanted to make a pretty easy transition to, uh, you know, new games. Because I don't want to just become a one-game channel. Uh, I want to be able to expand out and do other things, but, uh, you know, this is the only way to build an audience. Uh, if we want... I'm sorry, my phone went off and kind of messed me up. Uh, if we want a diverse audience... The only way to do that is through new games. So, we are here in No Man's Sky. Let's go. It was a pretty hard choice choosing uh, what game to play. And I'll shut up so you can watch this. That's really pretty. Okay. I think we're about to go. I'm excited for this. This is going to be a really fun playthrough. <laughs> this is going to be a lot of fun. Okay, and here we are in No Man... Oh my goodness, look at this. Look at that. This is such a gorgeous game. I love the art style. So... We're here in No Man's Sky, and like I said, this was a really hard decision to make. We could have played a ton of games, but, you know, I've had a lot of fun with this, considering they've updated it and uh, made it an actual playable game. Yeah, they've uh, they've put a lot of work into, you know, making this game great. Uh, I was one of the people who pre-ordered it way back. Uh-oh, I forgot about that. Let's go ahead and fix this. I was one of the people who pre-ordered the game when it first came out, and uh, if anybody remembers the game when it first came out, it was not the greatest. You know, it had a, a lot of issues, a lot of failed promises, but uh, unlike... Oh, are you kidding me? Unlike a lot of developers, they actually took the time to fix the game, uh, make it even better than some people had anticipated, and really made sure it lived up to what it had said and you know uh and all for free no dlc not a single thing to pay for uh so that was awesome and i'm really excited to to give this a whole playthrough like i was saying it's uh, where did the other one go i thought there was a second one there's some hydrogen over there we'll go over here um it was a hard choice to make oh my goodness there's just so much going on I can't even talk it's awesome uh, I was going to play, you know, maybe Seven Days to Die or City Skyline, Civ 6. But, uh, like I kind of touched on in the intro, I wanted to make sure I gave the audience, uh, you know, enough to bring in the new people. But not be too different as to, you know, push away my KSP guys who watch for KSP. I wanted to, you know, give everybody a platform where we can build a foundation for the channel. And I'm just way too distracted. Oh my goodness. I need to chill out. I'm too excited. Okay, so let's chill out and see what we need to do. We need to head to the ship. Oh my goodness, look at that. Look at that. The art style in this game is just awesome. And we got a, a little ways to go. Now I do know the basics of No Man's Sky. I played when it first came out, which I know a ton has changed. Uh, I played a little bit off camera. That way, you know, I don't have to spend too much time editing silence out for me not knowing what I'm doing. So, uh, I wanted to make sure I, I knew at least a little bit. Oh my goodness, look at that. Look at that. Can I turn off the HUD and take a screenshot? I'll have to figure out how to turn off the HUD. Because that is awesome. Okay, let's head down. Is this like a, a big old cavern? Cobalt is going to be one of our early sources of credits or units. Are they called credits or units? I'm not sure. But uh, either way, it's going to be one of our early sources of money. Sorry, my phone keeps going off. I'm just too distracted. Too much going on. I apologize if this isn't up to quality standards. I'm trying my best here. I've got a pretty busy schedule this week. 
Uh, I've had to do stuff all day, and so fitting in time to record. I really want to make a consistent upload schedule, but it's... Uh, oh my goodness, is that an exposed technology module? Yep, it is. Uh, making a consistent upload schedule uh, when you have so much to do can be hard, so I really have to fit time in. So uh, I hope the quality isn't too diminished and it's still enjoyable to watch. I also have to get used to uh, live commentary. I've been doing post commentary with KSP, so I got, oh wow, look at this, we got a little cave here. What's this? Is that cobalt? Yep. Okay, so we'll... Uh, We'll kind of make a little mining station here before we leave the planet. Let's kind of check out what this is. Uh, that's nothing. Uh, what else we got? Anything useful? Sodium is very useful. That's actually going to be useful later. I'm hoping the uh, music's not too loud. Should I turn that down a little bit? Yeah. Let's go ahead and turn that down. Just a little bit. And then we'll check out the distress beacon. Separation failure, vessel emptied. Hmm. Let's just go ahead and do this. What is that? What is that thing? Oh, we got some oxygen right here. Whoa, game's kind of glitching out. Where did that monstrosity go? What are you? I don't have my visor, I can't scan it. That's a shame. Let's go ahead and get in the ship. What do we gotta do here? Everything's broken, of course, you know. They can't just give you a free ship. Free ship, YouTube. That was with a P. Don't demonetize me, even though I don't make money anyway. <laughs> I'm not partnered to YouTube yet, so... Don't even have to worry about it. Pretty much say whatever I want at the moment. Okay. So we've connected our exosuit. What's broken? Is it the same thing? Is it the same ship every time? Or can you get different ships on startup? I'm not sure. I think you get the same ship, but I could be mistaken. Okay, so we need metal plating and a seal. Do I have enough to make metal plating? I do not. Let's go ahead and get some uh, iron. Is that enough? Not yet. Almost. That should be enough. I'm one short, of course. Okay. We can make metal plating now. And this should lead us on the chain of events to get the uh, seal blueprint and then... Yeah. I apologize if I'm going a little too fast. I know tutorials aren't always, uh, you know, the most most fun thing to watch. So I want to go ahead and get through this quickly so we can get into exploring this massive universe that we have. Let's get some assistance. Okay. Whoa! We got the Predator over here. Or alien? Alien predator? Yikes. Xenomorph. That's pretty far. Yeah, how far is that? Oh, actually, that's not too bad. Yeah, that's pretty far. Could be worse, though. What is that? What is... How much are you worth? Quite a bit. I think these are some of the things you can give to the NPCs in game. Uh, you can get them 
little things and they'll uh they'll help you in your journey they've definitely done a great job of making the world more alive making it feel like you're in a you know very active universe is this cobalt no ferret so they've done a awesome job with that one of the really great changes they did how close are we uh oh we got a big old storm coming in how much sodium do we have enough for one more recharge or about half a recharge that should be plenty i think oh yeah we got a oh man look at that it looks so good let's push through this storm Okay, and we've made it to the station. Okay. And we've got some sodium over here. We'll go ahead and grab that. And all kinds of stuff. Oh my goodness, this storm's hitting us pretty hard. Let's get inside. Okay. Is this what we need? I think so. I think... Yep, there we go. I don't know if this is the blueprint, though. Is it? Yeah, it's the blueprint. Okay, we can make it. Now, I know there's some nanites in here. At least I thought there was. Let's go ahead and fill up our life support. Kind of check what's in here. I guess there's not anything in here. Hmm. I thought there was. Alright. Uh oh. Okay, we need carbon nanotubes. Can we make those or are we gonna need another blueprint? Okay, no, we just need carbon. Ow. Okay, that should be plenty. Oh, once again, we're just one short. Okay, now we can scan stuff. Let's go ahead and scan as many animals as we can. And plants. We're gonna get lots of units and nanites for all of this. We gotta get back to scan the predator over there. The big old xenomorph. Is that all? I think that's all the animals over here. Let's go ahead and scan some of this uh, flora. Is this flora or is it fauna? Is fauna animals and flora is plants? Is it vice? Yeah, flora is plants. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and journey back to the ship just cause there's no reason to watch that entire journey back. So I will see y'all in just a second. Okay, and we have finally made it back to the ship and i wonder if the creepy xenomorph thing is here yep that's a shame hopefully he'll respawn now we should be able to fix the ship and actually launch let's check and then our launch thrusters we just need pure ferrite yeah now we just need pure ferrite i think this is where it's going to give us the uh refinery and we can go ahead and just refine the, the pure ferrite. There we go. Okay, now we can get the refiner. Sweet. So now let's grab some more ferrite. We need some carbon too because we're about to be out of our mining beam. That should be plenty. Let's go ahead and... Do we not have any carbon? I guess not. Well, first, let's go ahead and scan this. It's a localized black hole. Oh, that's cool. How much do we need? Do we just need 50? Or was it 100? It might have just been 50. Yeah, let's check that out. I think it was just 50. Yep. Sweet. Now the ship is ready to go. I think before we launch, though, I want to go ahead and mine a, a little bit of cobalt. Before we head off world. Although we can find cobalt anywhere. I don't even know if this is a real significant deposit. Yeah, not really. We can find better deposits of cobalt elsewhere. Yeah, we can always find a better concentration of cobalt elsewhere. Let's go ahead 
and head off world. See what other planets are in this system. Here we go. Whoa! Is that an Earth-like planet? No way. In the same system we spawn, is there already an Earth-like planet here? That would be crazy. I want to go check that out. Yeah, let's go check that out. Okay, and here we are. Oh no, is this a toxic world? I guess we're about to find out. Oh, it is an Earth-like world. Uh oh <laughs> It is. Let's go ahead and land our ship here. Look at that. We found an Earth-like planet in our first system. Huh. Pretty cool. All right, so we finished the tutorial. And uh, I think that's where I'm going to leave off uh, today's episode. I know this was probably pretty short and uh, pretty concise. But uh, I just wanted to kind of put this out here, see how it does, see the reaction to it. And uh, there's definitely a larger universe to explore. I want to do the freighters and... You know, there's all kinds of cool stuff to do, and the base building's really intuitive and fun. So, uh, yeah, let's see where this goes, and I hope y'all enjoyed watching. Let me know what y'all think, or what you'd like me to play, or, you know, give me all kinds of ideas. I comment back, and I definitely read pretty much everything. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I will see y'all next time.